Oh, welcome. Uh, some set a new game on the channel. I don't know if anyone else has this problem, but uh, I have so many Steam games that I've never played. <laughs> and this is one of them. This is Thomas Was Alone. This is one of the more memorable platformers or well-known indie platformers. I just don't think I've ever played it. And I was like, oh, I didn't realize I had this game. I was looking for a new game to play on the channel. Why not this one? Man, the vibe of this game. Thomas was alone. Uh, I love the video, but let's turn it down just a little bit. Resume. Wow. A weird first thought to have. Yeah, kind of true. I think this is a hundred levels for the main story, at least. Thomas decided to start listing his observations for posterity. One, oh, the music in this game, the whole alone rules. thing. Two, portals. They led somewhere. He'd yet to work out where. Three, falling. Thomas was absolutely fantastic at falling. He was almost as good at falling as he was at observing. I mean, I could have finished a little early, but gotta play the video. It's so good. Oh my god. This okay, game's so beautiful. Interesting. Thomas couldn't fall past this block. Think, damn it, think. What if there was some kind of inverted fall? Some way to. What's the word? Jump. It worked! Thomas had solved the great inverted fall mystery. <laughs> Sound effects touch loud. We're so close to. Oopsie. Oh no. Hmm, a little less, actually. Here. That feels about right. Come. A big button. jump. But Thomas noted there was no real danger in missing it. The world didn't want him to fail here. It was pushing him, but gently. What did that go so far? Let's go. I'm popping off. This all seemed a little dangerous. Oh, no. The world was not to be trusted. It was unstable, and it seemed to Thomas that it could let him down at any moment. He was starting to suspect. Oh, no. I missed dialogue. Thomas wondered whether the portals were actually taking him anywhere. He felt like he was making progress, but there wasn't really any way to know. He seemed to be moving predominantly up and to the right, which might or might not be important. Who is the voice actor? It sounds like... Oh my goodness, I can't remember the name. He's been in so many things. He was Frodo in The Hobbit. Uh, Arthur Dent it in might have Hitchhiker's been paranoia Galaxy. again. But I don't Thomas think it's him, but it sounds like him. The world was becoming more complicated. It always seemed to be one step ahead of his skills. It had been designed just for him. He wondered why. Was the world testing him? Oh, i got to stop cutting off dialogue. It's so good. Something about the boiling, toxic, glowing water intimidated Thomas. He didn't like it. He certainly didn't want to swim in I it. I swear... The game disabled my jump note. button. For water. I got good scammed. <laughs> there is no way I didn't hit jump there. The game scammed me. Okay, that was me. That was me scamming me. Man, this game is gorgeous. Also, the controls feel so tight. Like, I'm a rectangle. <laughs> I get it. But it feels so tight. Oh, I can't go that way. Never mind. Come. Oh, what the? This looks very the complicated. The loneliness was getting to Thomas. No amount of observation or obsessive note-taking could combat that. It really does sound like him. I'm going to have to look it up. I don't think I'm going to finish the whole game today, because I think it's about four hours. But uh, I will definitely look it up between this video and the next video. Come. 
We could break it up into like 20 if it's 100 Thomas levels, I guess. Thomas had a new theory. The world was oh. training him. He could feel himself getting smarter. Wait. There was the mental list to consider. Over the minutes and seconds since his spontaneous generation, he'd become a pretty skilled jumper. It's so cool that the text moves. He was evolving. Oh my god. He just wished he had someone to share it with. It's so cool that the the text moves with you. Also, um, the shadows in this game are crazy good. Uh... I just hope none of these can kill me. Oh, I see. I think. I think I see. I think. Maybe I don't think. Oh, God. Ah! Alright. I thought I... Okay, so I thought if you were on them, they sunk down. And if you didn't move on them, they went up. But I think that's not true. And it's just kind of random. <laughs> I think I had a bunch of jumps get eaten there too, but that's probably a skill issue. Chris took an immediate and deep dislike to the skinny oh. red Who the hell did this Thomas think he was? That's cool. So it's a puzzle game. It's a puzzle platformer. I genuinely didn't know. That's so cool. Chris Wait. had been doing fine. He wasn't the highest jumper, but Chris, please. he'd held his own. He'd even been graceful at times. Well, not actually. Not technically graceful. It's probably, probably the wrong word, but you know, fine. There was That's that skinny little runt leaping about like he owned the place. Oh, I see. The bottom right is the characters I have access to. Oh, goodness. This game's... I mean, so much about this game is wonderful already. Oh, my God. Am I gonna... No. The game's presentation is really nice. Here. I got you, buddy. The music is incredible, though. Like... I mean, the sound effects, they're really strong, too. But this game, the music is incredible. Huh? 1.3? Okay. This was more like it. A glowy white... thing. Only Chris could get to it. Which, of course, made it all the more enticing. What would it do? What new opportunity might this switch open up to him? <laughs> great, great. Another chance for Thomas to jump slightly higher than Chris. How fortunate. Seriously, this made the whole switch pressing thing entirely worthwhile. I see. Uh, this seems fine. Yeah, it's gonna happen every time, isn't it? Yeah. Man. I feel like I say this about every game because, I don't know, I think I, I like speedruns, is the honest truth, but this would be a really interesting game to watch speedrun. Because, <laughs> like, the movement Was isn't good? the best thing because ever. on the surface, it did not seem good. Chris was pretty scared. Little Red seemed fine. Happy to be on his merry little adventure. Chris couldn't shake the feeling that things had taken a significant turn for the worse since Thomas had joined him. Sure, he'd been able to piggyback his way to ever so slightly higher platforms, but where had that got him? Well, to ever so slightly higher platforms, which was sort of his point. Oh, I... Didn't mean to miss that jump. Oh. Is there a float? Yeah, there is a float. Oh my goodness. Nice. 
No! Wait, is it Gucci? Oh, I'm flexing. Let's go. Thomas, please. Oh! I'm trying to flex on him. Oh my goodness. This game is very peaceful. This was the palette cleanser I needed, I think. Man, how do so many people make so many good video games? Kind of ridiculous, honestly. 1.5. Can I look around the map Chris at all? stared at Thomas with pure hatred. No. He seemed so very so. happy at their situation. Friends together. A brave fellowship of quadrilaterals on a quest for greatness. <laughs> <laughs> that would be fine. But it was all the obvious observation that Thomas was doing which grated. Every time they saw something vaguely new, Chris would hear a satisfied little hmm from the vaulting idiot. He hoped the next portal would split them up. If only for a few levels. Oh god. We're fine. Excuse me? Excuse me? Oh, that's funny. Can I not make it up there? Alright. Looks like... Wait. No. Wait, can I even make it across this? Do we figure this out yet? I think I can. Is there a run? No. Nice. I'm supposed to go down there. Maybe I'm supposed to go get Thomas? I mean, Chris. I'm Tom. Wait. Come back. Come back! I mean, there's no way Chris is making this jump, right? <laughs> oh, goodness. Some level of... Let's go! I'm yeeting. No! Yes! <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna keep going. I think Chris is gonna catch up with me. That's my guess. Yeet. Oh, no. Yeet. Uh, all right. Bye. Oh, goodness. How do I get old made out? Holy smokes. Can I not get over there? Okay. Nice. Let's go, Chris. Oh, he's pogging. Oh, do I have to, like, let him over? Yeah. I think he can make it himself from here. Yep. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm so pog. Yeah, you just have to touch it, I guess. Oh! Hello! John knew. He knew that this was his <laughs> chance. A moment to shine. This was game day. Wait. Holy... Wait. Is this legit how you're supposed to solve this level? <laughs> Okay, I'll take it. I think probably. This would not do. John needed room to show off his exceptional skills. Oh, right. As it was, he was trapped on the wrong side of these little dot things. Oh. Where did they come from, anyway? <laughs> That's really fun. Man, even the sounds, like... Thomas has this little zippy jump. Chris is this, like more bassy. And even John has like a higher pitched version of Thomas's sound effect. John inhaled the air of the open space and it's Oh my goodness. I'm of popping up. Awesome. Wait, now what Time do do? to flex those muscles, to put his training to use time to show those little dots how it was done. Yeah. 
John decided to press the switch to let the little dots catch up with him. John can cared I, I for his new allies. No. You so can tell this, which is from very the funny, sympathetic but... expression he practiced in the mirror Fudge. all these years. I should stop talking when the voiceover is happening. It's actually so good. Man, Chris, why you gotta be so slow, man? I gotta mind that you can't jump a lot, but your speed is killing me. Uh, this. Nope. Like this <laughs> Thomas is so happy. I mean, I know this game is all about, like, you'll never know how much compassion you can feel for a quadrilateral, but it's true. All right, I'm out of here. Oh, we need Chris. All right. Let's go. Oh, that's cool. It's a fun bit of movement tech. Get on top of. No. Okay. So we need Thomas's help again, maybe. How do I get? Okay, hang on. I'm about to. I'm about to try something real quick. We're about to build. Let's play. Uh. Oh. Oh. Never mind. I thought it was a void. I'm stupid. Let's go, Chris. Wait, how do we get across? Can you jump over there? Okay, you can. So then, I think Thomas needs John's help? Yeah. Ah! Okay. You got it. Uh! Nope. You don't got it? Maybe. I feel like probably. Um, sure. I mean, I know I can stack John them, but was happy I had a to feeling. Keep helping. He felt it was important to his image that he oh, was no. seen to help the little guys. I was gonna say, I feel like it's important. Oh no. Oh no. Can I? Uh, I think John needs Thomas's help? Maybe he needs both. But yeah, I think about the Mario flagpole a lot. How so many of them had... Oh no. How is that not enough? Alright, whatever. Out of the way. Uh, you're coming too. Uh, nope. Wait, other way. You here, you here, you here. That is also not enough. All right, game. Oopsie. I hit the button. Oh, okay. That's cool. So, wait. How do I help them get up? This? Well, that's not gonna do it. <laughs> All right, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Build some step. I mean, that would work. Let's do this. Do this. How? Uh, huh. Hang on, how do I do this? Wait a minute. Is there a switch? Let me just go explore for a second. Okay, no. Now I have to use my brain. 
Uh, actually, do I? I mean, this could cause such disease in my brain. Damn. I was really hoping that would work. How do I... So I need to get Thomas on top of... John. Or would it work the other way? Hang on. Maybe? Probably not, though. No, right. Yeah. How... Am I supposed to do this? So I'm pretty... Hang on. So, Thomas needs John's help. John also needs... But Chris needs both their help. I don't know if this is cheating or not, but we'll see. Okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> Never mind. Can't be cheating if it doesn't work. Can I do that? Wait. No, that doesn't make any sense. That would be the funniest thing ever, though. Because... Hang on. Okay, so you can bump them slightly with the other ones, but not very far, which makes sense. Um, here, let me see if John can find anything new then. Otherwise, I assume I have to he figure didn't out that little puzzle. So much either. The red one, Thomas, had a charming way of applauding every time John jumped. The angry orange one was less immediately likable, but his unremitting cynicism and tutting amused John. I don't know what that is, but I'll take it. Uh, I think I have to get them all up here, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I do. Okay. How do I do that? How do we solve the stair puzzle? We thought we were cruising right along, didn't we? Uh, is hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, will that work? No. Oh, that will work. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. <laughs> I was thinking about stairs the whole time. I didn't build stairs. Uh, John can go on, I think. Chris needs Thomas's help. John's too big. Oh, wow. My guy. I get it. I get why you're cranky now. Uh, Thomas is good to go. And I think we'll do the same thing again, right? Maybe this will just work. Damn. Build some stairs. It's so funny, like, it was such a... Oh. Uh, I think Thomas can make it, actually. It was such an obvious thing. But it took me a little bit to figure it out, and the joy of figuring it out is very palpable in this game. Okay, so I've already figured out that John can make all these jumps solo. Let's get these two up here first. And then, looks like the goal is going to be to get Chris up there. Uh, here. So we'll start stacking them on the elevator. Nice. Get me on! I think Thomas can make it. Nice. And then... I know John can make it on his own. Whoopsie. Alright, everyone off. Hang on. We're cooking. More cooking required.
Eh. Whatever. This will do. Really? I think he can make it. Damn. That's fine. Everyone's home safe. Right? Well, okay, we'll just make sure. Nice. Wish I could push each other a bit more. Remembering which character you lost selected is actually surprisingly hard. Alright. I think it's the last level we're gonna play. This was interesting. A floating target. I assume this it's would safe. require coordination, balance, and timing. John was sure the dots would be lost, but he was happy to guide them to triumph. It might be that actor, by the way. Martin Freeman? Is that who I'm thinking of? It seems like him. Uh, here. Let's do this the fun way. So Chris has to go down there. Oh. Uh, like this. Maybe that's what the dots were for. They were there to extend John's reach, to make his performance even more impressive. Uh, okay. John liked the thought. He decided to keep them. Thanks, buddy. Oh. 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 Think. Nice. One more level. Oh. Okay. I think this is a good time to stop because there's our this is a natural break in the game. What an incredible game, so, by the way. This was how Claire would die. She knew it would happen eventually. Okay, never mind. I have to play this level. She so was sad. Rubbish at jumping, and she moved slowly. She felt a little like. Her continued existence was breaking some kind of natural order. The crumbling pillar was a dramatic death, she supposed. Bye bye. Wait. What? Oh. Claire couldn't shake the feeling that she was not, in fact, dead. It was at that moment that Claire realized she had superpowers. Okay, that's sick. All right, all right. We'll end it here. She Next need a video. Cape. There was no getting around that. You couldn't be. Next video, we'll be back. This game is incredible. I can't believe it took me this long to play it, but we're going to play it in chunks about this long or so. Uh, if I had the time, I would one shot it, but uh, I don't. Instead, I'm just going to take my time and enjoy myself. Thompson it alone, absolute banger. If you've never played this, uh, get on it if you have played again. Thanks for hanging out. See you next time.